I'm going to briefly go over all of the assembly lines in Power World and how they work. The first assembly line that you'll unlock is the sphere assembly line. This is the only one that doesn't need power, and all of the assembly lines essentially work the same way. They all have massive material requirements as well, but the sphere assembly lines will allow you to make special spheres and also make spheres faster. The production assembly lines will let you make special materials, and they're also necessary for certain blueprints. And the weapons assembly lines will allow you to make certain weapons, as well as being necessary for certain weapon blueprints. The last assembly line that gets unlocked is the weapon assembly line 2 at level 47, but I'll go over how the assembly lines work now. What makes the assembly lines a little bit unique so if you want to craft something, you can have yourself and up to four pals doing it at the same time, which can make it very quick. That's for including yourself if you're going to work at the assembly line too. What I like to do is you can either lift one of your pals like this, and then throw it at the assembly line to assign them there. Or if you have a certain pal in your party that you want to work on the assembly line, you can just throw them out at it and they'll start working on it. So they have to have handy work in order to work at the assembly line. For the ones that do need power, you're going to need to make a power generator, which you'll have unlocked by the time that you need any of the power generating ones. And then you'll just need a pal that can generate electricity assigned to your base, which I believe is every electric type. Finally, if you're trying to make something that says it needs production assembly line 2, there's actually a bug that I don't know if it's been resolved, but but it can potentially rename your weapon assembly line to production assembly line 2. But the real production assembly line 2 does not unlock at level 32. It unlocks at level 42. And this is the one that you need for any of the things that say they need production assembly line 2. And that's pretty much all you need to know about the assembly line in Bell World.